G'day guys, Aussie Fifa HD and welcome back to another marquee matchups video on the channel. Now it's only going to be a short episode today, however lads, up in front of your screen as you see, we are going to complete the marquee matchups, which guarantees you an 84 plus team of the week player part. Can I complain? Not really. Thank you EA for at least adding SBC uh, in the dying stages of FIFA 17, because there is absolutely nothing to do in the game at this point in time. It's dead as hell lads, but as you see, in each of the SBCs inside the marquee matchups, you do receive your yourself a 25k pat so you do indeed make quite a few coins when you are <coughs> excuse me when you are opening these because you know you do receive a lot of fitness cards a lot of contracts a lot of position modifiers that do go for a few thousand coins each so you can't complain much about that as you see in this one we've got Eric Bailly which isn't a bad return in my opinion Eric Bailly goes for a few thousand coins and obviously he was around 10 to 15k at the start of the game because of how overpowered he is this year but you know it is dead FIFA 17 is over. FIFA 18 is out in just a few weeks, lads. Not long at all. Uh, you know, just I can't wait. But, you know, Arab Bayou only goes for around 2,000 coins an hour. But as you see in the in the American uh, versus Costa Rica SBC, we submitted that one and I basically just did a, a full um, a full MLS team there because uh, I was able to find a Costa Rican MLS player, uh, which uh, obviously linked to all the other MLS players. And as you see, lads, we do indeed receive another red gold player pack now. Now, or red gold pack. Now, as I said before, you do receive quite a lot of coins because of the contracts and consumables, which means you do considerably get the 84 in form 4 considerably f free. Now, I did say considerably a lot there, but you do you do get it for, uh, you know, fairly free because a lot of these do sell. You obviously complete the marking matchups from around five to 10,000 coins each, and you roughly do get around 5k pack per pack uh, you know, if you don't pack anything, even if you don't pack anything, so you do receive your coins back. So basically, you get your 84 plus team on the way player pack for free. If you indeed get something lucky, you'll obviously make profit from it, which um, I didn't get anything lucky in these ones, but. Uh as you see, lads, we do discard the rest, and I'm back up to 9,500 coins. So as you see, you know, we just keep grinding it out and just keep selling the players, and eventually, you know, you do make your coins back, and you do get it for free. But as you see in this one, we do submit a full Argentinian side with just a Randy, uh, Randy Uruguayan left back there uh, that I did <coughs> that I didn't really... Um, that I didn't really pay much for, you know, I only paid for around four to 500 coins for it. And I'm sorry if I'm coughing at the moment, I'm very sick. Well, I'm not very sick, but I'm fairly sick and uh, it's painful to talk right now. So do bear with me with that. But as you see, we do get ourselves Koulibaly an 83 rated centre back from Napoli. Now, you know, the 83 rated players were going for around two to three, four thousand coins, uh, you know, uh, mid year. Now they're only going for around 850, you know, just goes to show how much this market's dropped. You know, I even remember the 82 rated players were going for quite a lot when an SBC required 82 rated players. I think it might have been 83 rated uh, SBC that required 82, and a lot of people were buying them up, and you know, they were worth a lot. But now, FIFA 17 is dead, barely anything is worth anything. You know, even Ronaldo, if you pack him these days, he's only worth 700k. You know, a 94 rated Cristiano Ronaldo, 700k. Oh my god, that's cheap. But lads, you see, we do submit a, uh, a, a full French team with Ven and Holt in that left back position. Now, I always seem, uh, I always find that the, when you put a uh, like an off cam player in left back, it doesn't affect the team as much because there's only two links to the left back. Uh, same as goalkeeper. If you were to put uh, a, a, a zero cam goalkeeper into the goalkeeper position, you would then obviously. Uh, wouldn't lose too much cam because it's only got two links to other players. But when you put an off link or an off cam player in the middle, then everyone loses links, and that, that's where you sort of need chemistry. But I did decide to put Van and Holt in that left back position, uh, and he he indeed uh, you know stayed there, and we uh, was able to get the chemistry. But as you see, lads, we do get ourselves Michael Carrick in that pack, the uh, the Manchester United legend. And as you see, a lot of consumables, a lot of contracts, a lot of fitness cards, and position modifiers that will sell in the future. We back up to around 4,000 coins, so it did cost me around 6k to complete this. But inside of our 84 plus 10 minute player pack, I was hoping for a walkout. There was no walkout, but inside, we got ourselves 
the uh, the right mid Spanishman Castiljiel or Castiljo. I'm not sure how you just pronounce that, but lads, not a bad super sub. 89 pace, 85 dribbling, 84 uh, passing. Certainly better than the super subs I have now. So I'm very happy with that. At least I can use him in uh, in you know when I'm playing divisions or when I'm playing you know friendlies. But lads, that was the marquee matchups. I do hope you enjoyed this video. Can we smash 20 likes on this episode? That would be absolutely amazing. Subscribe if you're new to the channel, and thank you guys so much for the support. And uh, you know it's just amazing. It considering P for 17 is dead, but that'll be it for me. I hope you enjoyed your day. Have a good one and peace.